Okay, your cell track is installed. What's next? How do you use it? Well, first you need to get a license key from Metronix to get it operational. And in order for Metronix to make you a license key, we need the MAC address of the machine that cell track is installed on. Now that could be a server, or that could be your local uh, PC if that's where cell track is installed. Whatever it is, you need to get on that machine and get that MAC address for that machine. Now I can show you a way to do it for my local machine. That's where my cell track is installed. You're gonna have to get to a command prompt. So if I click on that little Windows icon in the bottom left corner and type in CMD in the search box, I'm gonna get the executable to bring up a command prompt. And then in that command prompt, I'm gonna type in IP config space a forward slash all and press enter now I have a whole list of all my uh, connections and I want my local area connection since this is on my machine now I don't want this first local area connection because this is my Cisco AnyConnect VPN into our remote access into our network at the main office what I really want is the true local area connection on my machine. So it is this physical address, and then this would be the MAC address for this machine. Now if I wanted to copy that, the easy way to do it is go up in this corner, go to Edit, go to Mark. Mark will allow you to highlight that. Go back up into that corner. Go to Edit again choose copy now that copied it and now you can paste that into an email and send it to Metronix along with the number of users that you need and from that Metronix has a little tool that we would put in your MAC address and say I needed 50 users we would generate this license key and then we email this license key back to you and that's going to allow you now to get your cell track started up so let's say now you have your license key back from Metronix now what you want to do is get to your cell track and you're going to do that from a browser and you should have the um, cell track IP saved so in my case it's on my local machine so it's just this local host and I have that bookmark so it'll come up but if I wanted to get into one of my remote uh, cell tracks that's uh, in our main office on the server I would click on that that I have saved and that's an actual IP address to go to but again for our purposes here I'm gonna go to my local host and now in here, for a username, you're going to type in admin. And for the password, you're going to type in admin. And these are case sensitive, so you have to have both with a capital A. And then press the login. And now you want to go to this license tab. And here is where you would copy and paste that uh, license key that Metronix sent you back and then just hit save until you were successful. If you had that correct MAC address, it'll recognize it, that it belongs to that machine, and it'll tell you that it was successful for the MAC address and the number of users that you purchased.